You do not need a license to openly carry a gun in Ohio, but you do need one to conceal and carry. Under Ohio law, county sheriffs handle the licensing process. Last year, Lucas County denied the most applications in the state, a little over 1,300. Michael Tater joins us live in downtown. Michael, what's the reason for this? Well, Dan, according to the AG's office, denials represent only 1% of the total applications for the year. But Lucas County led the way in denials in 2019 with 188. Now, Lucas County Sheriff's Office says it's hard to pinpoint an exact reason for why this is, but a deputy that I spoke to says he believes that it could be changes to state and federal laws in recent years. Now, I spoke with Sergeant Robert Boggs, who leads the records department here at Lucas County Sheriff's Office, and he says anyone applying for a concealed carry permit needs to take a gun safety training course and then submit the $67 application. Now, before March of 2015, you could have committed certain offenses that did not disqualify you if a certain amount of time had passed. Now, Boggs says there is no time limit on certain charges like drug offenses, and domestic violence. Five years ago and first applied for their CCW, got it. But then in 2015, when the law changed, now they're coming to renew it. And the background check is showing that maybe 10 years ago you had the domestic violence. Well, now we revoke your CCW. You're no longer allowed to have it. And now Sergeant Boggs also says that the federal guidelines for purchasing a firearm have gotten a lot more strict in recent years, and that could be leading to more denials as well. If you'd like to see the full report from the AG's office, we posted a link to that on WTOL.com. For now, reporting live in downtown Toledo, Michael Tater, WTOL 11.